What is good, chat room? I'm C Fresh, and this is Aegis Esports Guilty Gear Strive Weekly number 26. Uh, I've got a rare treat for everybody today. Let's go. You got immediately back up around. Start wants to get a great confirm there. You only get that guarantee on counter hit. Every time I see Jack, I always feel like when I say this, I am accusing them of hacking. I'm not. They they have flaws, you know, you can't beat them, but they just have this machine precision to the way they play that is so impressive to me. Like, is that two just blocks in a row on Yozansen's incredible stuff? We were talking with Tree Gun, a really good Happy Cast player, and talking about mm -hmm. everything Happy Cast 2K does, and he was just like crying, laughing, because I'm like, oh, the Abare mix up pressure start anti air low profile button. He's like, Perhaps. You just have to use solid defense to get out, and we see it there from Red Ditto. 6 beat Trey, but a big whiff throw. We're gonna get a counter hit combo. Probably taking him all the way to the corner on that one. And doing a great job, because you know, if Viking gets in once, you die. You really can't afford to miss that anti here. Bombo's on board, baby! No. So just spatial awareness, and that block string call out with the, with the parry. People like to talk a lot about like how good parry is or like if it's actually not that good. But I will say the one thing for it is it really makes you doubt your own offense. And this late in the bracket, you know, having those mental hiccups like that can really send you to pieces. Yes, sir. I Like I said, I've been so impressed with what Drews is doing with uh, Oscar right now. Like, I think a lot of people, a character comes out and they'll post really grimy setups on Twitter. They're like, oh, if you spend 100 meter, you can get a single high low. And I'm like, I, I sleep. I could not sleep harder. <laughs> That's just, it's not a core part of the character. I'm unimpressed. Yeah, such nasty damage for a zoner, man. I, I, I will be complaining about those axle damage buffs till I die, which will be soon with that axle damage. Goodness. Honestly, I'm not so convinced that, uh, you know, Milia can't play a better neutral game. I think her buttons are lacking fair to Kai, but the, the speed on that character is so preposterous. She can really play a mean whip punish game on you, like we just saw with that DP. That's going to get you some damage. Yeah, I always like to say I'm such a strong Danny believer. I think some people see uh, a net play warrior like this, and they think like, oh, he plays a bit random. I don't know, because that turns for a real world experience. But I think, you know, it's not randomness like risk taking is a skill and so if you think danny's random there must be a a method to his madness to uh, be getting these wins over top players and we're in the next round speaking of keeping it a buck hester luck will always keep it 99 blood with you uh, he will never keep it a buck that that blood meter was hovering 5d in this economy y'all have 5d money out here i'm living i'm out here living 5p to 5p and y'all have 5d money Miranda's is giving that long pull up into it. Aaron gets the flash kick kill. <laughs> you feel it coming. Yeah, it's like you feel bad for somebody taking Bridget pressure until all of a sudden Bridget is taking Leo pressure and you're like, ooh, ooh, now I feel gross. The fascinating thing about this match for me is that Kai has the privilege of getting to play at any range he chooses. You know, you can play Fireball Wars full screen, you can play with his good buttons, you can play up close, run that strike throw. And I wonder if Stealthy will adapt by just trying to force that long range, force that zoning match of his axle or whether you know, they're willing to pull up and fight it out in the mid and close range as well. And they're just getting hit by it. They should just block, block you know? No punish on mix, mix, mix there. Can be a really funky move. It's got four hits and they are steerable. So, you know, you have to be really confident about your punish on that one. You see, even the Faust players don't really know how to punish that. But no, we're gonna get caught by the 5K, forced to burst early and really try to keep SQ out. That's the thing about zoner bursts, you know, not all bursts are built equal. And honestly, this, this burst right here is letting Smitty run the game plan. Finally getting some distance. Can't even pull the gun though against those ram sword normals. We will see if he has to get through Rat first. Rat just seems to have uh, had the momentum now, you know, the, the extra vitamins. You, you can't fool me, man. I know he's got Remy Ratatouille hiding under that Milia hat. They got footsies in this thing? Skull fighting for their life. Danny on set point here. One hit could do it. You cannot afford to get hit by those stun edge. Can you resist the Faustian urge to go like that afro? 